Hello everyone, Lucas Eddy here with Climb. Today we're going to be looking at the new flare float jacket for the ladies. This is based on our rift float jacket for the men, which you guys can check that out as well. Super popular. Basically what this is, is an independent float system for snowmobiling. So if you're out on the frozen lakes, frozen rivers, and you fall through the ice, you can wear this jacket and you don't need additional flotation bibs to float in the water. I've done this myself. I've worn the men's version of this jacket, jumped in the water, and I just floated there basically multiple times for the camera. So check that out as well, and it does work. You don't need additional flotation bibs like you do with other products out there. So let's check this out. First things first, we've got a quick release removable hood up here with that uh, plastic rail system there to quick connect the hood, super easy. And then moving through the jacket, we have two hand pockets right here, super easy to work with. And then up at the top on the chest, we have a Napoleon pocket there behind that front flap next to that zipper. So you don't have to unzip the jacket to get to the chest pocket. And then underneath the arms, we have zippered vents right there. So you get a little bit hot on the trails, you're kind of moving around off trail, you can unzip these pit zips there, get some more airflow through the body. On the inside down there, we do have a powder skirt underneath there at that bottom hip area. That's gonna help keep that powder from flowing up into your jacket up in the powder. But the key thing here I need to talk about is the Ascent Float System. That's a perforated foam. I don't have any on hand to show you, but it's a white perforated closed cell foam so it won't absorb water. And it's layered all throughout the jacket, all throughout the arms, and it's sectioned and it's form fitted. So it's not really gonna inhibit your mobility very much, but it is gonna add 60 grams of insulation. So we have 180 grams of regular 3M synthetic insulation plus that 60 in the foam. So you have about 240 grams of total insulation through here, really warm jacket. But again, that float system foam is the key thing here. It's gonna help you stay buoyant in the water. Now, that being said, normal trail jackets from Climb, because of the synthetic insulation, because of the Gore-Tex construction and all that, they don't sink like a rock. That's a common misconception. They don't just sink straight down to the bottom. The point here is this floats better, keeps you higher up in the water, easier to get out. And when I talk about getting out, let's look at the arm sleeves here and the lower cuff. If you wanna fold that back, Vanessa, we can see mesh in the sleeves. There's really big mesh, you can barely see it, in the sleeves there. And the same thing is all the way around the bottom hem. And in the women's trail gear, it's also at the bottom of the pant leg. But the point here is, water will be inside the jacket, inside that insulation, just floating around, not getting absorbed. And when you get pulled out of the water, you're gonna be super heavy with all that water weight unless it can evacuate the clothing. So that's what the point of that mesh is. So you can see in the video, when I get out of the water with the Rift jacket, water just dumps out of the sleeves and out of the jacket. So that's gonna make you lighter as you come out, easier to get out of that frozen water. So the last couple things on the flare jacket here, we have some reflective hits and some high-vis color options as well. So when you're in the trees, it's kind of weird light out there in the Midwest and it's hard to see. Hopefully this extra visibility will keep you a little bit safer there, avoid any kind of head-on collisions and that kind of stuff and make you easier to spot out in the snow. So that there is the flare jacket, the women's float jacket. So if you guys have any questions, hit us up in the comments. Find us on Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, TikTok, all that fun stuff. We'll be out there. That's all for now. Thanks for watching.